يقول راجي الخالق هو الأمين الوافق حمدا لمن هداني لسنة العدنان محمد المختار وسيد الأطهار الحمد لله الذي يستجاب لمن دعا والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله أما بعد The venom of shaitan and the hostility and the animosity and the aggressiveness of the shaitan jinn will never stop until the devil knows that there is no tawheed pulsing in your heart. Around the world there is a lot of people who are looking for cure. Muslim and non-Muslim. But the Muslim deep down they know that the cure belongs to Allah. You'll hear the saying, oh, the cure belongs to Allah. But, Sheikh, I have to go and seek other means. Because these people, shaitan, has taken the tawheed which was pulsing inside their heart. And the aggressive nature of the shaitan, they don't absolutely recognize it. That's why they go back and seek help from the magicians. Who are the workers of shaitan? I'm talking about those people who are hit by spiritual disease. And spiritual disease is loads. Not only jinns and evil eye and hasad and uh, magic. So those who are specifically hit with the magic, they go and seek help from none other than shaitan. While they know the king of kings created magic and magicians but the magician use various means and ways to harm son of adam magic has been proven in the quran and the sunnah and the magic which is mentioned in the quran is very strong and the one who is been mentioned in the sunnah it is very very strong and magic comes with four categories the fire the water, the air, and the dust, or the sand, or the mud. And all these four have branches, loads of branches connecting towards one, either the fire, either the air, either the water, either the mud, or sand, or turab. And then they do whatever they do. Today I'm going to talk about magic of the antenna or the magic of hanging. In Arabic, it's called Sihrul Mu'allaq, the magic of hanging. He hangs in the neck, he hangs in the tree, he hangs in the window, dead tree, etc. The list goes on. And this magic works with the air. It renews with the air. Every time there is air, the magic gets renewed or it becomes stronger by the qadr Allah. This magic is one of the wickedest magic. Sihr al-Mu'allaq, what do they do is write it. Either they write down in your clothes or they take your belongings or your picture. They write it and then hanging. But the expert of the magicians, he just needs your name and pum. By the will of Allah, he hits you. And then they hang it in the tree and there we go. You start having problems, spiritual problems. But what needs to happen here is, even if you have spiritual problem, you should not turn and seek help from the devil. You should seek help from Allah, Rabbul Izzah, the one who created the magician and the magic. Sihr al the symptoms are different from any another sihr, another magic. But every other magic have three signs. This is absolutely common during the night the day and the salah the individual will find it difficult to pray the individual will find it difficult to sleep the individual will find it difficult to earn his living this is to do with any other magic at day sihr al this sihr is rooted from the magic of the air now what are the symptoms of this sihr if you have these symptoms know that you've been hit by Sihrul Mu'allaq. The individual will find 
himself lethargic tired laziness can concentrate at all and when he exposed to the air he start feeling dizzy that he want to collapse head pain heaviness in the head frequently insomnia dizziness disorientation dreaming a lot and dreaming of someone is chasing dreaming of dogs as well sometimes feeling something is crawling all over your body when he's praying salah or when he's reading the quran his mind is absent there lack of concentration now how to move forward from this type of sihr or this type of majid one needs to seek istiana towards allah and one needs to be patient and dua frequently and salah five times azkar morning evening and if you do this wallahi i repeat by allah you will be better in one sitting read seven surah to baqara seven surah to baqara in one sitting in one sitting read seven surah to fath in one sitting read seven surah to dukhan do that regularly if you are working do on the days you are not working wallahi you will see the benefit of it and do frequently dhikr you will overcome your sickness by the will of allah remember if you have sickness in your heart there is no chance you can cure your body so you have to focus on the heart cleanse the heart and then the body will be sound by the will of allah rabbul izza stay tuned for more inshallah by the will of allah اقول قول هذا واستغفر الله لي ولكم فاستغفروه انه هو الغفور الرحيم